Welcome back to another Waterfowl Wednesday, and today we're going to be answering the age-old question, where do I duck hunt? Okay, so I'm not going to be answering the question where I duck hunt today because I'm not going to tell you where I duck hunt because what person tells you where they, one, catch big fish, or two, kill a lot of ducks. That's just against the rules. So what I'm going to be doing today is telling you where you can find places to duck hunt and possibly have very successful hunts. First things first, I would say to go over to your State Department of Wildlife's website. I know in Kansas, it's ksoutdoors.com, and look at the migration reports. I do this all the time, and so once the season starts, or even before the season, they do bird counts at different places where you can actually go duck hunting in all the different wildlife areas. So check those out and find the ones that are closest to you. Generally, if there are migration reports, there's places where you can duck hunt. Also on the website, you can find lists of all the different public lands and find the ones that are closest to you. And I'd say the best thing to do is just drive out and find the different places that you can go. I know there are some different places that have maps in Kansas. I don't know about the other states. I've never really spent much time hunting in other states, but I know for a fact in Kansas, there's PDF maps and all these different things that help you find places to hunt. So check out your Department of Wildlife's website. The second thing I would tell you to do is go over to Walmart or a sporting goods store and pick up a hunting atlas for your state. The hunting atlas basically just shows you all the public lands across the state that you can go to. So if you can't find public ground to hunt on or your public ground is not very good, you need to bump up your scouting. And I would say to go over and look at private lands. And I will make another video talking about how to approach landowners and get permission to hunt on their properties. but. Long story short, the easiest thing to do is find areas where there are birds. Like you know there are birds in this area. Like there's a wildlife refuge here, but they don't go to where we hunt on the public ground. Maybe follow them from that refuge to where they feed and find out who owns that field. And that will be the best chance for you to find that place to hunt where you're gonna have an awesome time. So that's pretty simple. That's how you find where to hunt. Um, I feel like this is something that some people struggle with, so I figured I'd make a video on it. And you know, don't be afraid to just knock on doors. It's really, really not that difficult. The worst thing that they're gonna tell you is no, and you just say thank you, and you walk away, and you go on to the next property that you think you're gonna have a good time at. So public ground, private ground, it really doesn't matter. Scout hard and find those birds and you'll be having a heyday. Go ahead and follow me on my social media. I've got a Twitter and Instagram and a Snapchat. Uh, you can follow me on there, it's on the screen somewhere. So check those out. I also have a Facebook, so if you wanna follow me on there, you can. I'll start using that more once I get back to school. If you like this video, leave me a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. I post Waterfowl Wednesdays every week and I also make fishing videos when I can. So check those out. That is all I've got for today's Waterfowl Wednesday. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you on the next one.